vlog my name is ebony so welcome 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 if you're new and of course if you are a returning gem or a gent welcome back so yes it is sunday it is the first day of the vlog um we're doing a, quite a bit of things in this vlog i'm not really sure how it's gonna lay out um but just to kind of recap um i think last vlog was the self-care vlog so this may be a continuation of that um but yeah so we recently um went out of town over the weekend we had a death in the family which was unfortunate so we had to go out of town to pay our respects and then um when we came back yesterday i had every intention to go ahead and vlog and just kind of get some videos and stuff recorded and i just rested the entire day and um, while we were out of town, I was able to go ahead and see my dad. But my dad is not an internet person. Like, he doesn't want to be on social media at all. So I'm probably not going to include that footage that I did get. Um, it'll just be kind of like family footage or whatever. So, yeah, it was really nice being able to see my dad and just spending some time with him and just, you know, the kids being able to interact with him as well. So we had a really good time. So yeah, when we got back, I was tired. My husband was tired. The kids was tired. So um, we just kind of relaxed yesterday. I'm trying to think what all did I do yesterday. I'm not sure. So um, either way, um, February 15th, that's my son's birthday. He will be turning 13. So this is a huge birthday. However, we are just going to still keep it kind of simple and cute. He doesn't have any friends in the area in the area that we live he has some friends um, from his previous school, but since COVID has happened, I haven't been able to keep in touch with anyone. So um, I wouldn't be able to do a birthday party per se, and I'm not really comfortable being around a bunch of random people um, even still. So it's just going to be a just kind of close-knit birthday gathering for him. Um, he's getting some items that he wanted, and we're just going to get him a cake. Um, I was going to do like a custom cake, but I think we're just going to do something just really simple um, because when we move next year, we'll be closer to friends and family and we'll really be able to really celebrate and do what we need to do. And we're going to be doing a lot of celebrating and a lot of fun stuff this year. So I'm not even worried about it at all. I just got out the shower. I shampooed my hair and I went ahead and blow dried it. I'm about to go ahead and just um, straighten it. I went ahead to the beauty supply store and I got some wig clips, but the clips that I got were kind of the bigger ones because I had made some homemade um, clip-in extensions previously. And um, every time I snap it onto my hair, if it, if it has too much hair in the comb, it kind of doesn't stay snapped. So the larger combs, it's gonna help prevent that from happening. And as you can tell, nails is dead. Toes is dead also, and they're the same color. Because normally I just keep my toes white, but I'm like, you know what? I'll just keep them pink. And let me tell y'all about that. Because y'all have probably already seen that. So I'm going to tell you the backstory. So went ahead, got my nails done. I just wanted to keep them short and pink because, you know, they'll grow out over time. I don't know what's happening. I've got a hangnail there, but they're going to grow out and then I can shape them up and put a design on them or whatever. But either way, get my nails done. That's good. So it's time to get my pedicure. And I have like an older, a older gentleman to do my pedicure. He's very nice, very pleasant. So I go ahead to dip my feet in the water. It is, and he's like, oh, how's the water? And I'm like, this stuff is ice cold. Like, what are you talking about? So I quickly um, took my feet out of there. And then, um, so that was the first red flag. So I'm like, how can you run me cold water? But something was going on with it. So him and the manager, they fixed it and they got the water nice and warm for me. And it was good from there. So then um, for my pedicure, I just went ahead and just did like a basic pedicure. So he did not get the cheese grater thing. Like he just used a pumice stone. So I'm thinking this old man don't know what he's doing. Like what? And at this time, I'm just like, you know what, Ebony? It doesn't matter. Just enjoy the pedicure. Your nails are basic. Your toes is basic. Like it's nothing extravagant about it. Just enjoy it. Whatever. You know, it's all about self-care. When I tell y'all, I don't know what that man did with that pumice stone. 
but my feet were smoother than they were when they used the cheese grater thing. And I still have a pumice stone here at the house. So I'm definitely going to go ahead and continue um, keeping my feet moisturized and then doing it. But my feet felt like baby soft and he was so polite, so pleasant. So I really like this nail shop because it's never packed when I go in there and they're always so personable. Like the owner actually walks around to the customers to ask us like, how's our experience going throughout our service? So I really do enjoy it. And um, but yeah, y'all. So that was it. I'm about to do my makeup because I need to record my hygiene routine, my lip, um, my lip, my favorite lipsticks or whatever, and I also need to record an intimates um haul, like plus size intimates haul. So I have all of that coming for y'all. By the time you see this vlog, those videos will already have been published. So um, yeah, you'll probably get two videos on Monday, one on Tuesday, and then you'll get this vlog on Wednesday. And also I wanna mention vlogs. I know I had this whole schedule Tuesday, Thursdays, and Sundays, but we're gonna scratch that for right now. I have something in the works as far as my schedule, and I'm not gonna speak on that right now, but either way, it's still a schedule. It's just, you know, Still being worked out so yeah um other than that i don't know what we're gonna do but yeah i'll be back i gotta get my hair and stuff done so yeah i will be back y'all i really had it in my mind to go ahead and just record three videos today and then still just vlog in between but i am burnt out it's midnight i cooked tonight got the kids together well my hubby cooked the meat i just made like a side dish or whatever so um, I just wrapped up recording a video. This is the Shaper Mint self-love or self-care video. They wanted me to do a vlog, but I just decided to kind of just talk with you all and just show you some of the pieces they sent me. Um, I might vlog in here um, a little bit, but we'll see what happens. But they sent me some really nice undies and stuff. So I wanna show y'all what they sent me. So they sent me this bra and chocolate with some really nice panties to go with it as well. And it's so crazy because I was just saying the other day, like I need some new panties. I need some more underclothes. Like I need to get some more stuff this year. Like I started building up my collection last year, but I really wanna get more stuff this year as well. And as soon as I said that, they were contacting me saying they wanted to send me some stuff. So I thought that was really cool. So then um, they sent me these really nice, seamless, um, high-waisted, briefer, pant brief panties. Look at how thin these look, y'all. You can tell these are going to be very comfortable. So yeah, I'm not going to get into all of it. Y'all definitely check out the video. Let me know some of the things you're doing for self-care, self-love for the month of February. For me, it's not just so much about Valentine's Day. It's really about loving yourself each day because at the end of the day we go through so much in this life we can't control what we see on social media what we deal with in our workspace sometimes we can't even control the people that we're with you know and how they their moods can flip and change and all of that then you got the kids and your family and it's just a lot so when we find ourselves just focusing on everybody else and what they have going on we can lose sight of what we care about for ourselves so self-care and self-love is definitely my main priority for investment this year. Like I told y'all already, some of the things that I was trying to do for me, just taking my time for myself at least an hour a day, and I've been doing that. Trust me, like I have been doing that. I went to the nail shop yesterday, did my pedicure, got my nails done. I've been taking bubble baths. I've been, I've been having my self-care moments. And it's not that I'm overwhelmed, it's just that... I can't pour from an empty cup. Like I have to make sure that I'm okay and I'm doing what I need to do for me so that way I can be the best wife, I can be the best mother, and I can be the best person I can be even on my platforms and even as, you know, as I'm working my job. So, yeah, y'all, I'm done rambling. I will see y'all tomorrow. I have a Poshmark order that I have to get shipped. I'm not sure if I'm going to the post office. I might get hubby to go. 
I did get some of these, um, well, hubby, he got some of these thank you cards here. Because I know once I start adding more pieces to Poshmark, um, I'm going to get more sales. It seems like every time I list new items, I get more sales kind of in bulk. Now, I did um, design my own thank you cards, but I'm not going to print them just yet because I have so many things that I'm, I'm working on that I'm not really going to talk about right now. But um, I will be printing my own thank you cards because these can get pricey over time, especially if you ended up getting like 100 sales. So I, I want to have mine printed on demand. But um, yeah, either way, y'all, this is the end of the day, it's Sunday, or well, it's 11.58, so, um, excuse me, it's 11.58, so it's technically Monday. So yeah, I am going to go to bed, I have work in the morning, and that's just going to be uh, all day, and then, um, yeah. I'll be back tomorrow, y'all. <laughs> All right, so, hey, welcome back to the vlog. Today is Thursday, February the 18th. No, fe Thursday, February 17th. I'm currently working out. Um, I'm about to, I did some new exercises that my husband showed me today that really got me going because I haven't been to the gym in like eight or nine days because I've just been recording and all of that. So I decided to just come today because I just have to have balance. So um, that's that on that. So I wanna show y'all how I make my settings for my workout. I probably burned already like 200 calories um, because I did some um, weightlifting um, and then I also did some exercising. So um, I'm gonna show y'all how I set the treadmill when I walk, just for reference if y'all wanna know. So what I like to do, hold on Savannah, just reset, reset. Hold on, baby. So I'm gonna hit quick start, and then I'm gonna hit select. Let me reset it. All right. So I'm gonna hit select, and I'm gonna go to weight loss because I'm trying to lose weight. Then I'm gonna hit select again, and I'm gonna go all the way up to my weight. I'm gonna hit select. Then it's gonna be the age, and I'm gonna just go to my age, select. So now it's gonna get me to pick my speed, and I'm just gonna go to 2.8 but it starts you at 1.0. So yeah, I'm gonna go to 2.8. So yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna get this going. So it is like 65 degrees today and we are gonna head over to the bowling alley just to celebrate Sincere. Um, he had a little birthday gathering at, or at my husband's parents' house earlier this week. And so that was a celebration, but it's Saturday, so we just wanted to kind of get out of the house. So we got him another cake. And um, yeah, just show y'all us at the bowling alley and um, show y'all us singing his happy birthday, singing him happy birthday. And that's all we're doing right now. And then later on this evening, I have a lot of recording to do. I have a lot of content coming out for y'all. So yeah, I will see you all a little in a little bit. I am gonna be here for a while. You're gonna beat me in what? In a one on one? A one on one for what? In bowling. Oh, okay. Alright, we'll see. So, Sincere is saying he's gonna beat me in bowling, so we'll see how that goes, y'all. But yeah, happy birthday! I know you already celebrated, but happy birthday! Are you excited to be a teenager now? Yeah. I feel like I, I can't drive a car yet. I need to get a driver's license. Uh, Don't be like SpongeBob and have to go a million times to get your license. Oh, my God. I I'm sorry. I don't think I'm gonna be able to help you with that. Your daddy's gonna have to teach you how. To, your daddy's gonna have to teach you how to drive. I'm start off like SpongeBob and make him write an essay. Mm -hmm. What I learned in boating school is. <laughs> what I learned in boating school is.
Um, celebrating sincere um, just took him bowling and got another cake and really nice time enjoying him of course in true Savannah fashion she decided that she wanted to dig her hand in the cake before we could even sing happy birthday but I captured all of that I'm gonna add it in the blog originally what I was going to do was I was gonna break up like the vlog um, because I already have a vlog completed but what I'm gonna do is condense everything together and this will just be a longer vlog and then I'll just start fresh vlogging next Monday on I'll start fresh vlogging on Sunday this ends the vlog I hope you all enjoyed and um yeah I will see y'all in the next vlog bye y'all all right y'all so I'm finally adding items to my Poshmark so I'm just taking pictures I use this white door as my backdrop so this is like a leopard print dress. It's like a two-piece set that I'm adding. And so yeah, I'm gonna have that there with the matching top. And I'm gonna insert photos and all of that, but just so happy to finally be doing this, y'all, and get rid of some of this stuff because I don't have space. Like, I really don't. And with us getting ready to transition and move and all of that, like, I just need to have everything make it make sense. So yeah. Y'all let me know what you think about this leopard print and check out my Poshmark. I'll link it down below. But yeah, by the time y'all see this vlog, all of these items will be up and hopefully they won't be sold. So that way y'all can have an opportunity to get some. I think I'm going to sell this two-piece set for probably $10 because um, it's never been worn. I've just tried it on once for a video and that's it. So yeah, y'all. Hey y'all, welcome back to the vlog. So it is Friday. It is literally like one o'clock in the morning, but this was the only time I had to record because the kids are sleeping. I'm not saying they go to bed this late, but this is like my me time. And I have to be up at eight o'clock um, for work. But when you're really going from the bedroom to the office for work, I mean, it's really not that far of a commute. So <laughs> either way, um, I'll be good. So, um, yeah, I'm about to go ahead and um, get a shower. Let me tell y'all, I use that Yoni Fresh. I don't know if you all have seen my hygiene routine that I just uploaded. Definitely check that out. But I use the Yoni Fresh tonight. It was Thursday, February 25th. No, Thursday, February 24th. So, use it for the first time when I tell y'all that soap lathers up much faster than my shower gel and at first when i was smelling it it just smelled like it had a hint of ginger in it because again i mentioned it had rose clay and it also had the organic apple cider vinegar in there let me tell you my skin smells so nice i have a nice fragrance on me like it almost smells like i'm wearing perfume but it's not overbearing it's mild and the soap got me squeaky clean now some people may feel like you know it's not good to use a squeaky clean soap but with me having the eczema i need the soap to be squeaky clean to remove all of the toxins out of my skin and then what you're doing is you're just going to rehydrate your body with lotion so that's the next part i'm gonna probably go back y'all look at my neck baby girl is coming down but anyway um I'm gonna go back this weekend and see what all she has because I need to get some lotion and I wanna get some more of that Yoni Fresh because now I see why it's her best seller. 
it really does what it needs to do and i mean it's been hours later and i still smell like i just got out of the shower so i want to get her arm deodorant and i also want to get um just some lotion or some body oil just so i can really get myself on a regimen because again it's all natural organic so yeah um definitely wanted to come back and give y'all an update on that and it's just i mean it's amazing it just smells so good like i can't even explain it how i smell like it is on my skin and it lathers up so easily like i just literally wet it with the loofah and it was already foaming immediately and i'm like oh my goodness like this is gonna be gone because i washed three times with that i was like i want to get all of this in so yeah um wanted to come back with that um because the initial review was just kind of like just telling y'all what I got. Um, I did get a Poshmark order because I added some more items to my Poshmark. And I have a few more items that I need to add now. But um, I'm going to go ahead and send that out tomorrow or I might do it Saturday. But they the order came in yesterday. So it needs to be done today. So hubby will probably do that. So you, I may not get that footage. Um, but I don't really know what all this vlog has. I've been vlogging for, since last week. So I know we'll have some stuff in here. I'm trying to keep my vlogs at least 30 minutes or more. So um, yeah, this vlog will come out Sunday, February 27th. Um, and then I have a swimsuit haul that I just got done recording that will be out tomorrow at 5 p.m. Eastern time. So yeah, by the time y'all see this, it's, it's just, it's lit. So yeah, let me show y'all what I got. So I work with a company by the name of Kindred Trends. They reached out to me. Hold on. So a company, let me get all this stuff out. All right. So y'all make sure you follow me on TikTok and Instagram. I'm probably going to um, get something to put in the video so you all can see that when I record. But yeah, y'all make sure you, so y'all make sure you follow me on TikTok and Instagram. That way you can keep up with like the things that I post because I do reels and stuff on there just to do like quick hauls because y'all know I can talk. So if you just want to kind of see what I'm hauling, um, that's a great place for you to go. So yeah, Kindred Trends is a company that has online swimsuits for a family. So it has for your husband, for it has for your spouse, it has for you and your children. And generally the matchy matchy stuff is for kids because once they become teenagers, they're over it. So I think for the men, it goes up to a 3XL. For the women, it goes up to a 4XL. And for the girls up to a size seven and the boys up to a size nine. So perfect. When I tell you these are by far some of the best swimsuits as far as quality and the way that they look that I have ever hauled, y'all. So it comes in a baggie like this that says, hello summer. And as you can tell, it has like the um, palm tree sunglasses, a starfish, so a dolphin, airplane. So I really like how much thought they put into their brand. But y'all, when I say you have to watch the haul for sure, but let me just show y'all some of this stuff, okay? Let me show y'all because baby girl is about to be snatched for the spring and summer. So this is my favorite. This is a one. Yeah, so this is my favorite. Favorite. So in the haul, I couldn't really explain the fabric, but it's not your traditional swimsuit, but this is a one shoulder ruffled one piece bathing suit it does come with the um the hygiene here so that way it's going to protect you there but look at this y'all it's a fuchsia pink it's a fuchsia pink one piece set super duper cute fits comfortably and it has a lot of control here in the fabric on my stomach so i felt like it was sucking me in a little bit and the girls were sitting the girls were sitting in all of these but also they have the mommy and me bathing suit so they sent me this two piece on here it's just like a yellow tunic with some sunflower and daisy um bottoms but look at what they sent for little Miss Savannah, y'all. So yeah, they sent one for Savannah. So it has, so they sent one for Savannah and mine looks exactly like this. So it has the rouging here. It has the sunflowers and the daisies there. And then it has like the little tunic here. And mine looks exactly like this to the T. So it has like the little padding for her chest area. Two straps that are adjustable there. 
and then it has the nice ruffle in the back. So hers is in a size three, four, a three T four T or a three year, four years, her size there. So yeah, definitely check out Kendrick Trends. I will have their link down below as well as the link to the video um, down below as well if you wanna check it out. So yeah, um, I am tired. It's almost two o'clock in the morning. I'm literally gonna have about six and a half hours to sleep, but I'll make that up because um, at this point, I'm just kind of like to a point now where I'm on my grind, I'm trying to hustle and you know, it is what it is at this point so the work has to be done and it's going to be done but the good thing about it is that with my job i was panicking during the christmas months like oh my goodness i don't know how i'm gonna manage this job this job is just it's made for me like it's perfect like i was telling my husband in a perfect world i wish i was doing what i'm doing now five years ago but everything has this divine season and time so you know it is what it is so i'm just grateful and blessed and appreciative of the journey but yeah um i'll be sitting down all day tomorrow for work but i noticed that in sitting down all day my ankle has been hurting and i haven't been working out as much throughout this week like i've only made it to the gym one time this week and that's because i'm trying to still find a balance with filming and, and recording and all of that because I have a lot of content that I have to record for y'all that's just in a box sitting. And I've just been trying to find a balance. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start just recording a bunch of videos like on Saturday. Like I'll just do my makeup and then that'll just be the same makeup and just keep my hair the same way or whatever. And I'll just record like three or four videos and then I can edit them throughout each day throughout the week and have them like scheduled to come out or something like that because I cannot afford to not go to the gym like it's my therapy I need it at this point but yeah I'm done rambling I will see y'all tomorrow this weekend we are going out I need to go to make um to Sephora to the beauty supply store we're going a few places this weekend nothing crazy um but yeah I will be back I will see y'all tomorrow or today later on today so yeah y'all see y'all in a second how you doing good how are you so i'm getting earrings today yeah uh, don't put this in your mouth on me say look at camera look at mommy's phone say i'm getting earrings look baby Anna, Anna, look, look, say I'm getting earrings today. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Oh, it's it's <laughs> hard. Hard. Anna is getting her ears pierced today. She's two, so I waited way too long. So here we go. All right. The only way that I know that I feel safe doing her ears is one arm across both arms and then put her head against your chest. But we have to have we have to have the place ready. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna get this Okay, sit with daddy, okay? Oh, so you can't do that. So you're going to have that whole... No, you're going to pull them. So listen to me. You got it one arm this way and one arm way up like this on top of her head and her head against your chest. Flower in your ear. It's going to be fast, Vanna. Okay, just a quick doing? prick. Really still. Really, really, really still. Go. Done. Got it. Okay, you're going to Good Great job, job baby! You got your job! You did! Great job, baby! Oh, good girl! Good job! Good They're job. beautiful! Good job! Oh my goodness! Beautiful! Banana, banana! Oh my goodness! Beautiful! Beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> Say thank, thank you. Lady. Say have a good day. Alrighty. Thank you so much. You have a wonderful week. Alrighty. Thank y'all. Bye.